All right. Uh, wow. So, I mean, we are in the presence of greatness here because the face of Twitch is with us mm -hmm. right now. That's me. Nick, Nick is Pog Champ today of the of the day. Yes, yes. Pog Champ of the day. Yes. So make sure you type Pog Champ if it's January twenty eighth, twenty twenty. Yeah. If you're watching you're on watching YouTube, this. then it's not really gonna work for yes. you. But if you're watching live right now, well, you can see somebody else be the Pog Champ of the day. Yeah. But dang, look at it go. Yeah. Wow. Is that weird to see your face in global chat? Have you seen yourself on random other channels so far today? No, <laughs> I, think, I think the, I think the general use of Pog Champ has gone down dramatically. Okay, <laughs> since it was changed, I feel like I don't know. In general, it seems it seems like people have sort of moved on since it's it's not yes. the. I mean, all the um, sort of uh, why can't I think of the word here? But uh, con oh, controversial oh, yeah. things around. Um, well, that was oh, a good warm up, I guess. Around Gutex himself. Uh, it people, soured the Pog his, Champ. His, his face was too iconic. Uh huh. And even like trying to do the face, trying to replicate the face, very hard. I don't Wait, think a lot so of people. So yeah, yeah, you that. you posted uh, like a bunch of the shots of you trying to replicate. It. So how did it? How this is like an interview. How did Pog Champ come about for you? Uh, I just got an email from Twitch that was like, hey, you want to do PogChamp? And I was because someone submitted me. They had like a submission form. Oh, OK. That people could put you in. Um, so I got an email out of the blue last week. And then uh, I actually <laughs> I had a couple. I had I did one emote and then I didn't like the lighting in it. So I oh, redid God. it. So I only posted the second I had. There was a whole other batch of. Uh, photos that I did where it was just my camera roll is just me making a stupid face over and over again. Oh no, I messed um, up. Oh god, not again. Um, see, okay, that's surprising because I figured what they were doing is like going through people who had emotes that kind of like they had an existing pog champ for their channel, but I guess so yeah. they, they're like getting you to just do it from scratch. It, I mean, that's not, they don't have any rules. Like, if you already had one, you could use it that way. Okay. I keep doing the same thing wrong over and over. I made it. I made it. It only took like five tries on something that should so have been I a first have, try. On my channel, I have a, I have a pog emote, which pog is a, like a, a variation of the pog champ where it's just the mouth, even though mine is sort of like a, just a zoomed in face. Okay. And I initially, I was going to use that one, but then I realized it's not really, I just keep, right. it's I did the be, same thing. Yeah, I, I did that like three times. It's gotta so be it like was, a full pocket. Yeah, it's like a full, it's a full face emote. So mm -hmm. I ended up re like taking a picture for it, which is funny too, cause I'm, <laughs> as soon as I tweeted about it today, I was like, I know somebody's gonna come in and say something about it. Cause people are so, such sticklers about their emotes. Right. Like somebody replied to my tweet, it was like, the thing is you could tell you're not genuinely surprised. And I'm like, yeah, I'm making, I'm taking a face for an emote. <laughs> like. It's, it, Twitch emailed me and they're like, you want to do an emote? And I was like, yes. I'm not going to turn down the opportunity. I feel like the one, the the pog that I have on my channel is actually like pretty, pretty good. Okay, what the heck? I think it's actually like as, pretty decent. As someone that's studied, I I have studied pog champ this yeah? past week. Oh my God. If you really want to improve your pog champ, to the to from everything I've seen in, in Reddit comments and on and on yes, Twitter, tell me what's wrong. How with to my pog make champ. your pog champ? It's facing the wrong way. It's okay, gotta well be that's easy enough right. to fix. That's, that's easy enough to fix. It is an easy fix. <laughs> the the main categories for having a good pog champ, which I really struggled with, is uh, obviously it's like a mix of both shock and surprise, with like a little bit of a smile, you know. Uh huh. There's like a there's like a it's little the there's little, a tinge the of a, the curl. beginning of a there's a beginning of a smile. The lip curl is also important, which I cannot do with my lip, both because I have just a fat bottom <laughs> lip and sort of a fat upper lip as well. <laughs> but also I have a mustache, so then it cover it covers right. my lip a little bit too. So it made it look like I did, had nothing going on. Yeah, and then also like willing, my cheeks. You're not willing to I, get rid of the mustache. No, not for never. For my one day the, emote, I will in never. The world what? Um, and then I also have a little bit of a beard, so that also kind of help like prevents because I have like dimples, but they're underneath my beard. Uh huh. So that kind of prevented me from giving more of a smile thing as well. 
Gotcha. Um, I'm hearing a lot of excuses there? right now, man. You kind of got to do a, a little bit of a side eye. That's one thing. Right, right. A lot right. of people just look forward. It's like a looking off to the side. Um, what else? God, the dissection of the pog champ is a very I detailed. I looked at art. the original pog champ too much. In fact, in the in the picture, in the actual pog champ emote, when I took that photo, I had pog champ up on my monitor so that I could look at it and reference it while I was taking the photos. I mean, that makes sense. It's kind of hard to do that. The, like, did you angle your face so that the direction of your eyes? I did. Was I was like, this is like a thirty degree angle. So I held the, I, I would start it parallel facing the camera and then I would angle to the side, get it nice and, uh, and I actually, I even went back and I looked at the source image that the PogChamp emote is from. It's from a oh, YouTube so it's video. like more detailed, yeah. And I also learned the history of the PogChamp emote. It's from a video called Pog Championship. Oh, really? Where they literally played Pog. Pogs. I had no idea. And that's why it's called PogChamp. What year is it from? Uh, I don't remember. It, it's an older video. I think it's been that emote had been around for a while. Was it on Machinima? Because didn't they do? They did a whole show um, on Machinima. I don't know. I think I I had just I would I would just had read about it. I didn't actually watch like the original video. I just had looked at some stills from oh, it. Okay. Um, Does the video not exist anymore? I don't know. It might be there somewhere. I mean, if it was on Machinima, it definitely doesn't exist anymore. Rip. All your Machinima respawn uploads. Dude, why? Why they have to go and delete them like that? The boosters are God, back at it. Yeah, they got away with it. They got away with it after years. They got 10 away years. with their crimes. <laughs> no more evidence against them. God dang it, dude! They were able to bury it. I have had to restrain myself today, being the Pog Champ. What do you the, mean? As many. Oh, you can't. With go many in. posts. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I, I just wanted to like make really controversial statements and be like, as Twitch's Pog Champ of the day, I declare, or yeah, I, I don't, I don't even want to say him on your stream. Oh God! Not that they're too bad. I had one in mind. Maybe I'll say it in between episodes. Oh no! Oh no! What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm scared now. Well, you know, it's not that bad, considering if you know the reasons why. Uh, Gutex was removed. Oh, well, yeah, I, I, I do know the the backstory of that. God damn. Uh, I guess it's really not actually that bad. I was just gonna be like, as the Pog Champ of the day, I am not a COVID denier, and that is well, all. Is it the weird thing about it all that like, in the beginning they were taking it super seriously, but as soon as that taking it super seriously became the mainstream thing to do, all of a sudden that wasn't the play anymore. That's what a bit it of seems a contrarian like it was. thing. Yeah. So it's not, it was not about what was true and what wasn't. It was about what's counter to Listen. the mainstream opinion on it. <laughs> Listen, the the populace uh, viewpoint, that's what the, what the sheep are. Oh, okay. Yeah. Listen, you can't, you can't not be a sheep if you listen to what everybody else is doing. I mean, which, which is. Yeah, no, exactly. Sorry, I was like the, trying to listen to the, to the, 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 the expert the double conclusions. Negative. Yeah, no, exactly. Exactly. I was figuring out the double negative. You can't not be a sheep. I was like, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, can't. got it. You're going to yeah, be I, a sheep. Even as I, even as I said that, <laughs> I was thinking, I was like, this, I don't know if this is right. <laughs> it feels wrong. Yes, but you have to be a good ambassador of Twitch, at least for one day. After this, you know, you can go back to whatever you I did think about also say. tweeting. I'm like, as the pog champ of the day, I think science is pretty cool. <laughs> Just like... I mean, I, I feel, feel like, like you'd we be should allowed probably to say that. listen to that. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna do anything like that. Maybe tomorrow I'll be like, as the former pop star, <laughs> pop champ of the day, the disgrace. I don't want to. I don't want to bring said... any heat to me or to Twitch. I don't want to do anything because I've never done anything with Twitch. It's for, not even like that. This was very serious, but uh -huh. I don't know. I don't want to ruin any <laughs> working relationship. I just don't know if Twitch knows that the their pog champ of the day is a massive brand risk. <laughs> They, did, they didn't do enough background research they on didn't. you, dude. They right. did not. They didn't check your history, all your tweets, see if anything. They haven't watched my VODs. <laughs> Man, that seems like a system that might come back to bite them on one of these future Pog Jamps. It's not too bad. It's just not, me, not uh, you I, necessarily, but I'm oh, saying it uh, could oh, yeah. for somebody. 
Well, that was a whole thing too. Is they had to change the way that they went about doing the pog camp thing because at first Ooh, they would. Zoom in. Uh, oh, zoom in! Oh, wow, I zoomed by you so yeah. hard. I was I gasped downhill like oh, go, like good sick. old times. That was sick. Woo, but so when boy. they first did the pog champs of the day, they would post on Twitter each day who the person is, and now they don't right. do it anymore because people were getting harassed over that. Oh, okay. I mean that's that's always nice. Yeah. Um Hey Bridget, Bridget joined. Hey she Bridget. Woke up. Oh yeah, and I also wanted to say I did do Pog Champ for the clout. I have gained five followers on Twitch today. Heck yeah! All right, it was a, it was a big business move for me. Oh, that that was a great return to trials right there. We will now break <laughs> for the YouTube video, continue on the live, and um, yes, bow to your Pog Champion on YouTube. It's not not he's not it anymore. Sorry, you missed Pog the buzz. Champion. 